<laughs> hey guys, Sri Lankan and Sammy. Sammy in Supik. I am here in beautiful, beautiful, but overcast today. It is a Saturday, but it is so beautiful. Baloy Beach, Supik Bay in the Philippines. I am enjoying a beautiful walk on the beach. It is a little bit um, uh, dirty on the beach today because we had a little bit of a, a storm yes, last night and it was windy and so it's all that crap is washing up on the beach as you can see. It is a little bit windy but the overcast is nice because it's not so hot. It has been insanely hot for the last couple of weeks. But today, really nice. I'm out for a walk on Saturday and today we're going to talk about, we're going to talk about life in the Philippines. My life in the Philippines. Why am I here? Why am I enjoying it so much? Why don't you join me? <laughs> All right, welcome back. And this is Baloy Beach, Supik Bay. And I am just walking down the beach. So today is a actually a Saturday, so it is busy. And we got we got the floating the floating bar over here and as you can see behind me the beach is really really busy and if you look down here where I'm walking it is packed with people I have I have uh, I've walked up and down this beach many times a weekday and it's never this busy but on weekends what I understand is that a lot of people from Manila come here to enjoy the quiet which it is it is quiet here and you can see you can rent a whole bunch of places over here to relax and enjoy now I found out why the sand is black here and this is the leftover ash from the volcano so that's another thing that I wanted to correct myself on so I'm going to talk to you guys today about what it is that I love about being here and it is the people I have traveled extensively. I have traveled Thailand. I've traveled Haraya. I've traveled to remote places in Thailand. I've been all over Sri Lanka. I've traveled to the Caribbean. Oh, the water is so warm today. Oh, it's so warm. Not cold at all. Definitely need to go inside the water. So. I have traveled everywhere and gone to a lot of places and I will tell you that the Cuba, the people in Cuba are great, the people in South Korea are great, but the people in the Philippines are insanely friendly and open and just spectacular about being friendly, overly friendly and share it. Like last weekend I was at a um, beach resort and having a great time and there was a family next to us and they were just inviting us over to drink and have a great time. So I will tell you number one are the people. I mean just look at this. It's, it's packed with people having a great time today. So I bet you someone's going to say hi, someone's going to say hello, someone's going to comment and come up and talk to us. So number two is the food. I really love the food here. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good to see you, brother. What's your name? I'm Christian. Chris? Sam. Nice to meet you. From Canada. Where are you from? Philippines. From the Philippines. Yeah. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> you like the island too? I, I, I'm just telling all my friends why I love the Philippines. Yeah, yeah. Number one, the people. Yeah, yeah, people yeah. Number one, the people. Number two, the food. Yeah. I love the food, brother. Be good. Have a great day. You see, I told you guys. I told you. Everybody loves YouTube. Everybody loves being on video. And they don't mind talking to, to friends. New friends. So that's one of the things I absolutely love about it here. So one of the things I do like about our beach is these, these cabanas here. You can rent these out and you can have a good time. You can cook 
and you can see that everybody is cooking over here. They've got all the food, everything available. They got their they got their kitchen set up and everything. There's our friends, our friendly neighborhood lifeguards, doing the best job on the beach. Best job on the beach. It's, it's just so great. So there, you can book these cabanas, and the cabanas will allow you to cook. If you want to purchase uh, barbecue supplies and everything, they have it all. Everything is here for you to do. So these are amazing places to come for the day. You pack all your supplies, you bring your food, you bring your drinks, and you bring the family, and it's just perfect. You have a place to relax, they've got bathrooms, they've got food, they've got water if you want to purchase it, ice, everything you need. And look at it, everybody out there is... I love it, I love it! My blood. Hey, say yes. hello to my blood. Yes. Hey, Sam from Canada, yes. living life in the Philippines. I love, I love it. I love it. I love it. What's, What's your, your name? Um, Thirdy. Thirdy Black. Thirdy Black. Dirty Blonde? Yeah. Thirdy. 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 I'm Sam from Canada. Sam, nice to meet you, Sam. Nice, nice to meet you, brother. Yeah, How are you? Yeah, yeah. You look oh, great. This is my friend in Canada. Those are those, those are your 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 yes, your, your 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 what do you call it? your uh, 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 oh Jesus what's the word your your cr criminals in, in, in no 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 <laughs> we are good. you know what I'm saying you, know, yeah, yeah, you guys yeah. are you guys are having too much fun yeah, too much fun too much fun today look at that it's great I love it shout out shout out brother be well have a great week thank you for coming. <laughs> they are just having way too much fun. <laughs> Everyone's having too much fun on the beach today. And this is the number one reason why I love it here way too much. Now, I'm going to assume that most of these people are from um, Manila. And, you know, if you go to a big city and you live in a big city, it's difficult to you know, be overly friendly with people because you don't know them, they don't know you, and it's just, that's the normal thing, right? But when you come to a small town like where I live and you, everybody's in a good mood. They all want to just enjoy the day. Now, this is also Holy Week, so it is uh, an important holiday. Um, it, it, because the Philippines is a ultra uh, Catholic, just looking at the seashells, sorry, ultra Catholic uh, country. So this week, you know, either everything is closed or everything is open. So the people here, like I said, the people here are incredible. I'm going to do a video next in the next couple of weeks on the food that I eat. So I have a cook that comes and cooks for me. So she makes really good food. So I'm gonna do a video on that. So we're coming up on, a, on another beach hut. And this is the last one on this beach before the end of the beach. So we'll take a look and they'll probably say hello and everything. Everyone's having too much fun today. Whose who's birthday? Your birthday. Papisim, what's that? We're Bible Baptist. Oh, thank you. Uh, uh, no, uh, my mother's Catholic. I'm sorry. <laughs> but uh, it's Holy Week, so yeah, I understand that. Good. Enjoy. Enjoy your time today. Thank you for coming. Where are you all from? Here in Sydney. Oh, here in Sydney. Me too. I just live over here. I'm from Canada. I'm Sam from Canada. Nice to meet you all. Bless you all. Thank you. You see, great people, great people. I love it here. This is this is one of the things that is just... How can I portray how happy I am? It's just... It's absolutely 
phenomenal. The the beauty of the people, the hearts. You know, most poorer countries get a very bad rap. And I'm going to address that right now. You go to Thailand, the first thing you think of Thailand, you think of Bangkok, you think of the red light district, you think of Pattaya, you think of Walking Street, you think of Philippines, which is almost the same thing. Now there is a red light district in the next town over, but not here. But you know, it, it does exist in that, all right? So there are people who come here thinking only one thing. And there are people who come here and think that everyone, like foreigners who come here and think, oh, that Filipino is only after one thing, my money. And that's true in any country. You go to any country in the world and the people are all after your money. It's just they do it in different ways. So when you come here and you experience the beauty and the pleasantness of the people without any strings you learn that human beings are actually good human good so that's my story that's my video for today because let me tell you you come here and you retire here you will absolutely love it if Number one, you're open-minded. If you are a pleasant person, if you are not an alcoholic, if you are not a sex tourist, you will absolutely love living here. I mean, you look at these people behind me. They've come to an area which is like technically closed off and they've set themselves up because they don't, probably don't have the money to pay for a resort. And they've set themselves up. They've bought, brought their food, their family, their everything that they need over here. And they've set themselves up in a picnic and they are having the best time ever. So this is just what I wanted to say. I wanna thank you guys for joining me, especially all of my Filipino um, brothers and sisters. Thank you so much for watching all of my videos. I'm really, really happy with all of my new subscribers. Um, over a hundred subscribers in less than a month. Normally it takes me three months to get that many subscribers, but thank you so much. Uh, had a couple videos go like really, really viral for my case. And I hope these videos do too. And I hope you join, like, share, subscribe, join my Discord server and learn to live life. Don't let life live you. Sri Lanka Sammy, Sammy and Supik, I'll see you guys on the other side.